welcome viewers, this is Danny here, and this is my new series, and it is called What Can I Build Out Of, and then I'll have the set name, and this is What Can I Build Out Of the Clone Troopers vs. Dreadicus Battle Pack. And so, basically what this series is about is, um, we all get those sets where it's a pretty cool set, but then there's like some, like a little part of the set that you don't really like, for example, the Clone Trooper vs. Dreadicus Battle Pack, yeah, these little droid because they're kind of dinky, not very big, don't really look like droid because. So, what I'll do is I'll take them apart and then build something new, so it'll look a lot cooler. So, first I'm just gonna show you this droid right here. This is from the Naboo Starfighter, and so this is a really good um, Lego droid I would probably say. If you compare it to the one from the battle pack. It is a billion times better. I mean, this one just stinks. So you're probably wondering, like, you know, what can I can I build another Droidica? And the answer is yes. Yeah, you can. Look at I build this. I built this one the other day. And if you compare it, it looks very similar. <laughs> very similar. Sorry, if not identical to the Naboo Starfighter one. It's it's a really cool droid, I really like it. And it's all pieces just from uh, the two droid so You have to take apart both of these droid and then you can build this. And I just I just really like how it turned it out. It, it really looks like a, a droid so it's really cool. And then you also have leftover pieces, and I just put them on this, I don't know, I don't even know what this is. But so you do have leftover pieces, so you can use it for mocks or other stuff. So, now that I showed you what the droid looks like, let's build it. Alright, again, so this is what it is. I'll just put it in the back there. So I have these two droid What you gotta do is you gotta take off uh, most of the pieces. You can keep the headpiece. You can keep this. Alright, I'm just taking apart everything. And so, once both of them are taken apart, uh, then you can uh, start building the new one. And so, you want to keep one of the bottoms of the droidicas, because that will be the bottom of the new one. So it doesn't matter which one. And like I said, one of the heads, too. You want to keep, so I can just leave, actually, I can just leave this part on here, just like that. So you use the head and the bottom. And that is basically the only pieces that you will use on that you need to keep from the old ones. So like I said, just take it apart. There we go. Alright, so now that I have all the pieces laid out right here, there we go. I can start building. Alright, so first we start with the bottom. Then you take one of these 2x2 two two, uh, brown circle pieces and you just put it right here. And you take uh, two of these uh, dark gray pieces. And you just put them facing so it's like this way so they're um, the top part of them is facing the one single leg in the back and then you take another one of those brown circles and you just put right on top of it alright next you want to take two of the white gray arms and put them on just like that so as you can see, that's the bottom of the Jodka. All right. Next, you want to do is you want to take this piece. This is the the head piece of the second Jodka, and you want to take this piece. It's a little T, and you just put it in, just like that. 
then it ends up looking like this. And then you connect it so that the bottom of the headpiece faces forward. And the so you can see it's just like that. All right. All right. Next, we'll do the head. So, like I said, you just keep the headpiece from one of the Drodicas. And then what you want to do is you want to take uh, one of the gun pieces, one of these, and then you just want to stick it in the back of the head so that the um, bottom of it faces up. So you have it just like that. And then you just take one of these pieces where you can put stuff in or it just clips on and then you clip it on just like this so the stud faces away from the head and then you just slide it as close to the um, main headpiece as you can and then you just connect that right on to the back of this so there you have the head so it's like the frame of the droidica. All right. Next, what you want to do is you want to put the detailing on the back of it. So you take this. This is also from one of the heads, and you just put it right on the back here. And then you take two of the studs, the uh, brown studs, and you put them on the top stud on this piece right here. On both sides you want to do that. So it looks like that. And then you just take the uh, little lever piece and you put it right below it just like that and then just slide it up. So this gives a little more detail to it. So it looks just like that. Alright, next is just the arms. So, for the arms, it's going to look very similar to um, the Nabu Starfighter Jodica. So, you just take the leg pieces from the Jodica you did not use for the actual legs of the one you're building, and you take the little um, tooth piece out, or a thorn, I guess you could say. And you gotta do that for two of them. So you just have these two. And then you gotta take another T and face it so the bottom of the T is out, just like that, and then put these on the side. So it looks like this, just like that. Alright, next you take two more of the guns. And then you take the little binoculars and you put the gun so um, the long part of the barrel is facing up. And you take the binoculars and you just put them on to the bottom just like that. Alright. So then you just attach that right to here now. And there you have it. So you just do that for both sides. There we go. So it looks just like that. And then you simply take another one of these pieces and you attach it again so the stud is facing away from it. And then there's one spot left on the middle part of the droidica right there. And so you just put it right in. Just, whoops. Right in just like that. And there you have it. So now, you took the little battle pack droidica 
and you just made it into a large normal size Dredka. So now I have two of those. So like I said, all you need is just one battle pack, and then you can make a pretty awesome looking Dredka. And then plus on top of that, you get all these leftover pieces. So if you want to use those for your mocks, they're pretty cool pieces. So that is it for this video. Uh, check out my channel for Lego Star Wars reviews. And I uploaded the new set pictures for next year, so check those out. Really cool. And yeah, so look for more of these videos um, of what can I build out of uh, different sets. So thanks for watching.